Greetings everyone, Slizzle466 here, and in today's video we're going to be looking at the new version of Even Shaman post card buff. So this is a version of Even Shaman that's running Thunderhead, which has had its health increased from 5 to 6, and the Stormbringer, which has had its mana cost reduced from 7 to 6. Now with Cuden to a Warrior, I always assume odd, so I'm just going to get rid of everything. If it's Pirate, we should still be okay. But what you'll notice with this deck is it's constructed a little differently than what we're used to. Uh, it's not running the Draenei Totem Carver anymore. And the reason for that is one, Fire Guard Destroyer is an elemental. And secondly, it has it has overload. So the overload part synergizes with the Thunderhead, and the elemental part synergizes with Earthen Might. So you notice that Earthen Might has been teched into the deck. So you've got a little bit of synergy between these six cards. It's, it's quite nice. So we know we're not running, we're not running the Die Wolf Alphas anymore. Um, so that those, those six cards give you a nice little synergy combo. Uh, you'll notice that on the Stormbringer side of things, uh, so we're not running Lich King anymore. Uh, and we're running a Mojo Master Zihi. And the reason for that is that there's a ton of Quest Mage in the meta right now, and it's really hard to deal with as an even Shaman. It's also a great card against Priests and Warlocks, and um, it's a tech card though. If you don't like it, you can always just put Lich King back in. It looks like we queued into a Dead Man's Hand Warrior. And to be honest, that matchup isn't that bad. If it's an Odd Warrior, you have like a 20% chance of winning. Against a Dead Man's Hand, maybe it's like a 40 50%. Blood is weird though, maybe as Patron. If it's Patron, we just win with Devolve. So he comes down the Thunderhead. It's not really going to help. It does, it's, a, it's not the best card in a control matchup, but it's excellent in an aggressive matchup, especially against Paladins. This card is a Paladin's Nightmare. It's very difficult to deal with at 6 health, and the Sparks just give you so much value. Okay. Hmm. I kind of want to play the Fire God Destroyer. But I also like the Thunderhead. We'll go Thunderhead. Because one, one thing to consider here is the sparks that generate reduce the cost of your Sea Giants. So that's something to consider as well. So I'm quite confused by my opponent's deck. The Dynamatic threw me off. But it, it, does, it does seem like Dead Man's Hand with the Warpath. He, he just used a Warpath to clear a Thunderhead. Just want to mention that. Okay, let's keep on put piling on the threats. Okay, I'm pretty sure they don't run Big Game Hunter. But if they do, I'm going to be upset. Against the big priests, it's actually nice to get the 4 attack version of that, because it's very hard for them to deal with it. Oh, I'm glad I attacked my weapon. I had a feeling he ran ooze. Okay, so we can Jade Lightning that. I'm pretty sure they don't run minor control tech. And I don't really care if he brawls this. So we'll just go ahead, get rid of that armor. Now as for my threats, I, I want to keep... Okay then. I wasn't expecting that. I was not expecting a mare on the fox. This guy has some class and I respect that. That is awesome. This guy's cool. Doffs, if you're watching the video, I think you're cool. I don't know if I want to see Giant. It's gonna bait a brawl. But if he doesn't have the brawl, I think I think it's okay. But I'm I'm not gonna hear a power. Okay, 
It's looking pretty good. So please no brawl. What you got? Uh oh. Blade flurry? Don't do it. Oh no, the punish. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's fine. That's second shield slam. It's an eel. It's pretty good. It will spread here. If he didn't have the brawl last turn, he's not going to have it this turn. So we'll hit there. There. Okay. Keep a slot open. I think Mojo Mat. So basically, in this matchup, I mean, all cards. Like Zihi and the Stormbringer are really going to help in this matchup. Okay, he got the Brawl. That's stank. Okay, well, that's a format 7-7. Seven, seven. We like those. So go ahead and play one, eight, play one of those. And then I'll coin out my Green main, and even though I don't think they run Super Collider, just in case. You don't want to be a silly goose and play into Super Collider. Hmm, I'd love another the Collider Oracle. I really want my Zihi and my Stormbringer. I've got a 1 in 7 chance of drawing either of them. Oh dear. What is that? That's terrifying. I hope he got... I hope, I hope he got call it oracles. Oh dear, he's got the big priest tech too. There's a portal. I like doing this. Oh, I don't like that. I can mill him. Is that, would that be stupid? Would that be stupid to mill him? I really want to. I'm gonna do it. I don't care. This is my YouTube channel. I can do what I want. Okay. Mill number one. Oh! Buccaneer. He won't have my control tech. Oh, okay. Oh no, my board. I needed that. We don't know what we don't know what his treasure card is yet. Hmm. Hey, there's our friend. I missed you, man. Good to see you here. Okay, now we just need our Stormbringer. Nice little uh oh. That's not too bad. Portal. I like Portal Jade Lightning. I would do the portal first. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. So we only see one minion getting cleared from the weapon. But I'm sure he has more removal. Oh, what did you get off this, the, the treasure? I really want to know. Okay. Crackle? That doesn't help me. Hmm. Maybe we can get a four. Oh my goodness. What a disaster. The question is, does our opponent run two dead man's hands? We milled one. <laughs> okay, he has four geists. That's kind of funny. Okay. Uh, do I want to devolve that? Not really. Okay. I'm ready for another Geist. Oh no, so many Geists. I think I'll devolve. Yeah. Yikes. Okay. Come on, Stonebringer. We need you. What's he got like? He's got a brawl still. Oh, there he is. There's the boo man. Okay. There's another one. What is that? Armor? We know he has two geists. That's all we know. Okay. Oh, what is that? Executo? Okay. Come on, Stormbringer. No, oh, never lucky. Uh, devolve that. Seriously? Seriously? That's so lame. No, infinite value. Actually, no, it's the only one. No more infinite value. He's got. He's, he's still got so many geists. Come on, Stormbringer! I need you. I need Stormbringer so badly. Oh, everything's gonna die. Okay, and then a hero power, another geist. Four minus seven, seven. Oof. Okay. Um, so if I buff it to nine, he can still clear it. That stinks. Four, four, nine. If I buff this though, sure. No, second execute.
Stormbringer. Why won't you come to our hand? I'm not never gonna bother here repairing. Come on, Stormbringer. I'm trying to make a point here. There we go. Okay, we got it. Here we go. Go, Stormbringer. Oh, got a taunt. And we lost. But we're gonna play a Stormbringer. That was pretty cool. Let's see if our opponent can find lethal. Oh no, bad manners. Classy way to go out though. Oof. So, what have we learned from this video? If you're gonna put Stormbringer in your even shaman deck, don't have it in the bottom five against the Dead Man's Head Warrior. Thank you for your time watching this video. If you want to support the channel, the subscribe button is below. And until next time, hope to see you again.